And now for a check-in with Taiwan's animal world. Many people across Taiwan go out of their way to protect creatures from danger. We take a trip to Qingjing Farm in Nanto to meet a sheep rescue team. The team of first responders help sheep that have gotten into scrapes. Meanwhile, over in Taichung, the city government has stepped in to protect a nest of newborn black swan cygnets. A sheep is lifted into the air as if riding a sedan chair. It's a simulation of what would happen if a sheep were injured. The animal is placed in this special stretcher and taken for emergency care by a vet. The Baba rescue team is made up of livestock experts who are in charge of animal care here at Qingjing Farm in Nanto. The sheep at Qingjing Farm roam freely in their fields. As such, they can often get into scrapes, cutting themselves on stones or branches. The rescue team is there to respond when needed. Workers at the farm carry external medicines for injured sheep. When they get a report of an injury, the animal is triaged. A minor wound can be treated immediately with natural first aid medicines. A more serious wound triggers a vet to be called ASAP. If a visitor sees this color, they needn't worry. It means we have treated the sheep in the past. Meanwhile, a pair of black swans at Taichung's Maple Garden have been brooding 12 eggs over the winter. In recent days, four adorable cygnets have hatched. The city's construction administration is taking no chances and has erected portable guardrails around the nest. Last year, a brood of cygnets went missing, with suspicions that they may have been eaten by predatory fish from the nearby lake. They fenced it off, so it should be better for them having just hatched some cygnets. It's four new lives. The plan to protect the cygnets will stay in place until the little birds are big and strong and can look after themselves when the fence will be dismantled.